that we have corn. And this is the first time Lieutenant Rachel Moore has seen the Barberton Salvation Army food pantry this bare. We probably have enough for maybe five families and that's essentially it and we will be out of food until we can restock our pantry. Most of the food you see here is for daily hot meals, but the Salvation Army isn't permitted to use it for the emergency pantry, where dozens of families like the Wilsons here get a week's worth of food to take home. Timothy Wilson doesn't know how they'll make it if these shelves stay empty. I'd, I'd be up a creek without a paddle, if you will. So, I mean, it, like I said, this place has saved our, our rears plenty of times. And the Wilsons aren't alone. There's a spike in need here. Barberton's one of Summit County's blue collar towns. And when some of the companies here closed down, workers stayed behind without jobs. But Lieutenant Moore says there are other factors besides unemployment. It was a, a father and a mother with six children, and they had just moved to this area. They were living um, somewhere else in Ohio, and their house had burned down. It absolutely, you know, just makes me feel brokenhearted for the need that's in the community. Although this food pantry is located in Barberton, it actually serves people from throughout the Summit County community. And now it desperately needs that community to help it continue to help others. In Barberton, Deborah Lee. News Channel 5.